What is the difference of gym or gymnasium to a dojo? This is very important for us to understand because it is here where we can differentiate what is really martial art compared to other sports. Okay, so here it goes. Gym or gymnasium is an indoor venue where we can do workout, where we can do exercise and sports. Whereas dojo or dojang is literally means a room to seek the way. When you say dojo, it means way. Jang means room or jom or jang means room. So a room to seek the way, you know. It is a, a how do you call this? A training hall for the spirit. It is a house for mental and spiritual discipline where you can go there, meditate. We don't just go there and uh, kick and punch and fight. No. Whereas in a do in gym, we go there directly, we go exercise, we do workout, we do sports. But in dojang, it's different. We respect the dojang. We bow to the dojang. We go there to meditate. We train our spirit, our mental and spiritual training takes place, not only physical. No? So of course we do their exercise, we learn how to fight, defense, and do whatever things. But first and foremost, we train both our internal and external aspect there. No? That's why we, it's, it's like a holy place that we give respect to. That we even bow to the dojo, we, we meditate there, we clean the dojo in respect to the dojo or doja. Okay, so that is the different the uh, the definition of doja or dojo. But nowadays, many martial arts just go there, treat the dojo as the, a gym, or they just go straight to a gym where they can just go kick punch you know train their body physical strength train how to fight train how to win in the competition so the value of the dojo is declining and the value of martial art is declining also we can no longer go there to train our mental development our spiritual development our character development no? that's why we produce fighters who are not good people. Hmm? People, martial artists should be good people. Martial art could, should change life, you know. I joined martial art to learn how to defend myself, to learn some self-defense skills. But based on my uh, expectation, uh, based on what I'm, my training, it's not what, my, what I expected, you know. When I joined Tungil Mudo, I learned to defend, I learned to uh, how to be uh, disciplined. And my training is not only physical. And my training applies to my daily life, to my family, you know, and become a better citizen because of my training in martial art. But, but that's not what I see to many other martial arts that's why we try to restore that's our purpose in our federation to restore the original values original core values of martial art the original values of a dojo and a doja and whether this martial art nowadays are training in the gym how we can transform their gym into a dojo again or doja how they can treat their gym as a dojo okay how they can treat their gym to train their spiritual aspect their mental the internal aspect no? that's why martial arts is declining because we don't treat anymore our training hall as a dojo or doja okay again that's the difference of dojo and doja and we really have to understand that uh, we don't only go there. For those who don't know martial arts, we go there in the dojo or dojang to train ourselves to become better people. 
we train people to change lives because we train in the dojo we go there we we bow in respect to the dojo we bow to our instructors to our masters in respect to the masters and then we follow the masters obediently and the master is supposed to stand as a model not only as a model in terms of their skills but as a model person in terms of their lifestyle instead of in, in terms of their character in terms of how they deal with many problems arising to become you know uh, selfless or whatever addiction or whatever uh, things that we cannot control a disciplined person a master should be a disciplined well-rounded uh, peaceful person which i myself as an instructor is still working on it up until this time but uh, you know this is uh, this is what is really martial art all about okay again the different that's the difference of gym and dojo okay i hope that helps you understand better what is martial art all about